It's nice for the club, isn't it? And and it's you know it's it's a competition like I've I've spoken about before that I've always had uh, you know a real good friendship with it really, and um, I've enjoyed good good spells in it in my management career anyway. I tripped to Chelsea in the third round, but, but my first year at Peterborough, I tripped to Aston Villa in the third round and gone and beat them in their own patch and playing Leicester on the TV in the fourth round. So. I know how important it is for the football club to get some money in, and I want to make sure we can, for us really, and, and the players, that we can, you know, we can give us get a, give a good account of ourselves down there, see if we can get into the next round, and you know that's where the big teams come in. Mm. It's great that you brought that up, almost unprompted. Sometimes it's about you know the cold hard facts of, of the finances, etc. But sometimes you think with the FA Cup that there's something been a, a little bit lost in it over the course of the past two decades, but. Clearly not with you. You've got examples there. Yeah, definitely. Def I mean, I think I, I think I speak for a lot of managers in in the League One, League Two, especially where you know it does. It, it could change your change your whole year around, really. If you if you get a run in the FA Cup, and I use Lincoln as an example. The last time I spoke to you about it and what they have done, and they've strengthened their squad. They've you know they've done a lot of things behind the scenes to make them a lot stronger. And wouldn't surprise me if they won League Two this year on the back of their cup runs. Um, and that's, you know, that's what I can do to a football club.